Oh! What? Oh! Welcome aboard, folks! I'm Admiral Bisk, and today we're playing some more to Majora's Mask. I was just breaking that box for shits and giggles, and there's a kid in there! What? <laughs> the fuck? Okay, I mean, I guess so. Sure, let's roll with it. So, last time we, uh, after having gotten cursed as a Deku Scrub, found out we gotta go get our ocarina back, talk to the fairy, she said go to the observatory, find out where he is. But, uh, now we gotta find all these children before morning. So there's, what'd she say, two left? So there should be one in the south, I thought he was down here, but I guess I could be, well, no, I guess, alright. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be in here, so let's check back out here. Little child. Little children. Where are you, child? I need to find children. The reason we need to find these kids is we need their code so that we can get into the observatory. Uh, the, we have to go to the observatory to find the Skull Kid, and the only way to get to him is through there. And they won't let us in without a password, so... That is what we are up to today. If I could just remember where the fuck they were, that'd be great. I know there's one in the... No, I don't want to be in the north. I want to be in the west. Can I go west, please? Can I go west, young Cooper? Can I do that? This is east. It's not what I wanted. Shit balls. Alright, hang on. I'm gonna find where this kid is. Alright, he is in the west. Alright, let's just get ready to... Shoot his ass in the face. What? Pop him! Yeah, get get fucking shot, kid. Get over here. Yeah, you little bastard, get over here. One guy. One more left. I want to say he's down here, but I might be wrong. Hello, Mr. Uh, Mr. Bankman. He's not? Shit! Where's that kid? Oh, no, where is he? Shit! We don't have much time. Is he out here somewhere? I didn't see him. Uh... I didn't see him up there either. Maybe he's up north, maybe? Question mark? Oh, this is not good. I need to know where this kid is. Oh. Uh, oh, boy. Alright, guys, I found him. He's just... I didn't notice... I didn't realize he was hiding behind this tree over here. Yeah, pop him right in the face. Sup, buddy? Give me that fucking password, kid! Listen, guys, all you gotta do if you want to find out a password is spit on children. Clearly. Don't don't spit on children. It's probably not a good idea. You'll probably get in trouble with their parents. It's pretty good for a Deku Scrub. If only you were human. Then I could give you an original Bomber's Notebook and make you a member. What do you guys think? No way, no scrubs. I guess not. Once we let someone, some kid who wasn't human join our gang, and boy, did we ever regret it. Sorry. Oh, probably the Skull Kid. But I'll teach you the code, just like I promised. I can tell you only once, though, so pay close attention. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, uh, oh. Code is 41352. And let me write that down so I don't forget it. Fucking 41352. Thank you. I think it changes uh, on your, like, depending on... I think it's randomized. Like, it could be different if I was on a different save. The entrance to our hideout is in East Clocktown. Cool. So now, we can head over there and get ourselves a Whatchamadoodle. So I think you, know, you have to find them as a Deku Scrub, but when you, become a, uh, when you become human again, I'm pretty sure all you have to do is pop the balloon and they instantly let you in. Or maybe you just tell them the code and they, they're like, huh, how the hell did you know that? Yeah, I got the secret code. Also, for some reason, this is the only kid that has a yellow hat. I don't know why. Uh, what do we got? Four, one, three, five, two. Bingo. There you go. Um, that's right. If you know the code, then you're a member, right? Okay, here you go. And now we can just go in. There's a lot of cool stuff at that telescope guy's place. Oh, yeah, and, um, the Bomber Secret Society of Justice Forever. Weird that they seem like a bunch of little children causing trouble, and yet apparently they're, uh, they w they do things for justice. Weird to think about. So this is the, uh, bomber's hideout, which is oddly, oddly dangerous for children's. Because I believe... Where is he? Where are you, son of a- I know- Ah! 
This big ass skull toe is down here. You tell me these kids come down here and don't get fucked by that? Like that thing doesn't come down and just eat them? I don't I don't buy it. Just go. Beep. Pop that balloon I don't care, Ta what do you want? I wonder how the astronomer knows the skull kid. Whoa, look at the time. You don't even have three days left. Yeah, I know. Time goes really fast in video game logic. Or video game worlds. Who's that? I heard the door open. Someone's in my house. Hello, sir. What's your deal? Yo, hey, baby. I'm a styling scarecrow wandering in search of pleasant music. Time will pass in the blink of an eye if you dance with me. I don't want that. Nope, 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 nope. I don't, nope. Don't, no. No, do not dance. I will need that, but not yet. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I don't care. I don't have an ocarina. So, he teaches you some really, really useful songs, actually. It's the uh, song... Come on, move. The song of inverted time and the song of double time, which one of them is used to make... Whoa, I forgot how pretty this place is. Whoa. Look at it. Ah, oh, I love the colors. I love when things are super colorful. I used to actually get a lot of shit. Uh, I remember in... Uh, Eighth grade, we were doing like a, uh, we had construction class, and we had like a, a slot car project we had to work on. Well, well, a strange looking child has joined me today. Are you a new friend of the Bombers gang? Hmm, your manners seem much better than those of your mischievous friend from the other day. Oh, you mean the Skull Kid? Yeah, he's not. <laughs> that ill-mannered troublemaker from the other day said he'd break my instruments. He said he'd steal my moon's tear. There was no stopping him. Even now, just watch him. He's probably causing trouble like all around the clock tower. Yeah, I'll take a look. Take a look at that shit. See what he's up to. Um, so eighth grade, we had to build like sock cars for construction class or something. And uh, there he is. And it was like a group thing. And me and my two buddies were doing ours. And you had to like bring in some plastic from like an orange juice container or something and then we melted it over a, a shape and it made the frame of the car and you had to put that on your little slot car thing and make a car it was really cool and you had to paint it up and i wanted to put all kinds of colors don't fucking shake your ass at me i don't want to see that oh, sweetie sweetie i'm coming for that booty um you had to like paint it up and i wanted to put every color there was on it i wanted to make it as colorful as possible and they were like Dude, what the hell's wrong with you? Just paint it like red or something. I'm like, nah, it's gotta be like a rainbow. Come on, guys, you gotta make it look, you gotta make that shit pop. I was like, you gotta make it look nice, you know? And they didn't like that. Well, did you find that troublemaker? And that loud noise, what was that? It was a fucking meteor or some shit. Perhaps another moon's tear has fallen nearby. Go look, that, go through that door and take a look outside. But I wonder how that troublemaker got on top of the clock tower. The only way up there is through the clock door, and that opens only at on the eve of the carnival. It's called magic. He flew up there, buddy. Don't worry about it. I ain't gotta explain shit. Where's this door? So I believe we can get a moon's tear by going out here. Which is a really cool item that we'll need for something else. Ah, yeah, here it is. Cool. So we are gonna need to use this for something else. There's, uh... There's a side quest you can use it for that, uh... There's actually, I think there's two different things you can use it for. One of them is a side quest we can't do until later on in the game. Um, because you gotta... The idea is you go to that, that Deku Scrub guy that was like, Hey, da, 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 don't use my property. We have to go to him, and, uh, he'll like... Whatchamacallit? What will he do? He'll... Give us his Deku Flower, that was it. We can use his Deku Flower to get a, a, a heart piece, but then we gotta bring his deed to another guy, get his Deku Flower, get a thing, then take his deed to another guy, and then his deed to another guy, and then we can get one final uh, thing. But you gotta keep trading deeds. Another thing you can do, which is what I'm gonna do as soon as we become human, is really funny and you'll see. But for now, we're gonna use this guy to jump forward in time, because we need to get to about midnight on the final day. So, uh, he's gonna dance. Oh, it plays Saria's song! Yay, I forgot! Dawn of the second day, 48. Aw. Yeah, it was pretty great. Went by in an instant, right? I'm still full of energy. If you like, baby, we can forget the time and dance until night. 
Yes, we will dance, in fact. Because we need to get to uh, the night of the third day. So I'm going to keep dancing with him. So I'll be back in a bit. Alright guys, so it's now the third day. I didn't go all the way to night because I want to make sure I get anything out of the way that needs to get gotten out of the way. But uh, so now that we're here, I believe we need to talk to this guy. And Town's Carnival is starting to look a little iffy. I'm thinking of closing up shop so I can get a gift from my wife and return to her to, in my village. I've heard that a stone called the Moon's Tear shines brighter than any other in the land. If you've got one, I'd really like to get get it from you. My wife would love it. If you give it to me, I'll give you my spot here, Deku Flower included. And I do happen to have that, so we can just give him a Moon Tear. Ah, that stone! You must hand it over to me! In exchange, I'll give you my spot here, Deku Flower included, yes? So he gives us this deed, which we can... That's what I was talking about before. We can use it to get another deed in another area, or we can do something else really funny with it, which we'll worry about later. But for now... Yep, yep, yep. She hasn't seen her eyes on a jewel or strange, sparkling a tone stone like that. I'm sorry if I mess up. The graphics are really weird, stretched out on my TV, so... That looked like an A for me. Sorry. Title D for this spot should be in high demand among Deku Scrubs, but you already know that. If you don't need it anymore, you can always sell it. So then he puts on his little hat, his other propeller hat, and flies away. Wish I had a propeller hat. He's got all these bags. Look at him go! Hee <laughs> hee! He just floats away! <laughs> yeah! So now we have his, uh... Oh, Jesus, fuck! I told you that dog was out to get me! No, you don't. No, 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 no! Go away, yeah, get in the water! Get in the water! Oh, wow, this one goes high. So we can use that to get... This! Boop! Harpies! I want to say there's another one around here. Oh, what's up? Door to the clock tower only open only op opens only once a year at midnight on the eve of the carnival. Yeah, I know. So we'll come back at that point, but I do want to check. I thought I saw another heart piece for some reason. I don't know why I thought that, but for some reason I thought I saw one up here too, on the side. Alright, no, I'm just insane. Alright guys, so I will be back when it's midnight so that we can finish up this little tutorial bit. Okay? Okay. Alright guys, it's midnight now. I've actually been sitting around waiting. <laughs> I didn't want to risk jumping it forward too much. So now, the festival's starting. Everybody's throwing off fireworks, and the clock tower's opening. Who opens it exactly? And this thing falls down, and there's like a big platform on the top, and this door turns into a staircase. So now we can climb the tower and get to the top. I don't really know why that opens. And I don't know who they expect to get up there. I mean, I had to fly up here, so... Don't stop now! Look! You can get up there now! So, uh, we've got about five minutes or so, I think, to do this. Or six minutes, I think. So now we're up here on the top, and there's Skull Kid, just hanging out. Looking at the moon, which is eerily close to the Earth right now. Messing with all the tides and shit. What's up, buddy? Don't play catch with my ocarina, dude. You might break it. Sis! Ah, Tail! We've been looking for you two! Hey, Skull Kid, what if you gave that mask that you're wearing back now? Hey, come on, are you listening? Swamp, mountain, ocean, canyon. Hurry! The four who are there, bring them here! Then he bops him in the face. Don't speak out of line, stupid fairy! No, what are you doing to my brother? Skull Kid, do you think you're still our friend after that? Well, whatever. Even if they were to come now, they wouldn't be able to handle me. <laughs> just look above you. If it's something that can be stopped, then just try to stop it. So he's throwing the moon at us, is the gist of what's happening right now. Everyone is going to die, and explode, and be dead. So... Kind of limited on options right now. <laughs> little, uh, little bit of shit going on. What we have to do is blow a bubble and hit the Skull Kid. Uh, blow a bubble and hit the Skull Kid? There we go. He gets, like, stunned by it and drops our ocarina. Good, good, cool. Go pick that shit. Oh, I see it. We gotta go get it. Boop. Got the ocarina back. One of the most important items in the fucking game. 
Gimme, 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 gimme. Suddenly, memories of Princess Zelda come rushing back to you. Do-dee-doo. You are already leaving this land of Hyrule, aren't you? Even though it was only a short time, I feel like I've known you forever. Why do I have Ipana? Did I just go over to Milan and be like, yo, hey, that baby horse. Fork it over. I'll never forget the days we spent together in Hyrule. We didn't. Uh, I met you once. You told me to go find the spiritual stones. That was about it. And I believe in my heart that a day will come when I shall meet you again. Until that day comes, please, take this. What is it? Oh, it's Ocarina, right. You already gave me the Ocarina. What, did I give it back and now you're telling me to take it again? I am praying. I am praying that your journey will be a safe one. If something should happen to you, remember this song. And she plays the Ocarina, the Song of Time, and we already know. Da do 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 yeah, I know the song. But ba do ba ba do completely out of tune, but it's whatever, no big deal. Do da do 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 dee dee do do boo dee do 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 I remembered the song of time! This melody lingering on the edges of your mind is a song of memories of Princess Zelda. The goddess of time is protecting you. If you play the song of time, she will aid you. The goddess of time? I didn't know that. Oh, shit. Except I don't have the ocarina. So, and this doesn't make any sense to me, but... Snap out of it! What are you doing lost in your memories? Get yourself together! Getting that old ocarina back isn't gonna help us! Somebody, anybody, goddess of time, help us please! We need more time! So, all we gotta do... Boop, dope, do, do, do. Conveniently, I just happen to remember that shit. I'm actually gonna put this on. Right, see, it'll work. Yeah, that's fine. So we just gotta bust out the ocarina. Huh? When did you get that instrument? Mike, I was just about to ask when he got the pipes. He picked up an ocarina, not pipes. When did you get that? I'm glad the game calls that out, though. I'm so happy about that. Oh, uh. Boom. I also adore the Deku Pipes. I love the sound they make. Yes, I would like to return to the dawn of the first day. Strange that you can only return to dawn of the first day. You'd think you could go further back than that, but... Whatever, I'll roll with it. Do do de do Now this is how you save the game, generally. You go back in time and it asks you if you want to save the game. Didn't this time, but... So this all happened, still. None of that's changing. Still got turned into a Deku Scrub. It all happened. Oh no, ah shit. Went and met the Happy Mask Salesman. Except this time... Instead of him telling me what to do... I somehow have the... I, I have the ocarina still, all of a sudden. Wh what just happened? Everything is- and I have my memories. But for some reason you lose your money and ammo, which is very weird. Start it over? And the moon's all the way back up there. What? What are you anyway? That song you played, that instrument. That instrument! Wait, that's it! Your instrument! The mask salesman said that if you got the precious thing back that was stolen from you, he could return you to normal! Did you completely forget, or what? So now we just gotta get turned back to normal. So we'll go talk to this duder. And, uh, he'll fix us up, and that'll be the end for today. Hey buddy, what's, what's good? Were you able to recover your precious item from that imp? Oh, 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 you got it, you got it, you got it, you got it! He's got this big-ass organ all of a sudden. <laughs> this guy's a fucking cartoon, I love it. Also, his head is on backwards. Ugh. Then listen to me, please. Play this song that I am about to perform, and remember it well. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. 
Fucking sounds ridiculous and I love it. <laughs> so now we get turned back to normal. We're gonna that was the song of healing. It heals your soul, I guess. So that Deku scrub is uh at peace now and is not possessing us. And it turned it into a mask. And we're normal. And I love that little animation of Link just like, oh, whoa. This is a magic melody that heals evil magic and troubled spirits, turning them into masks. I'm sure it will be of assistance to you in the future. Ah, yes, I give you this mask in commemoration of this day. Fear not, for the magic has been sealed inside the mask. When you wear it, you will transform into the shape you just were. When you remove it, you will return to normal. Which is really fucking super cool. I would love to be able to turn into a Deku Scrub whenever I want it. That's awesome. Think of the cosplay po uh, opportunities of that shit. <laughs> you get the Deku Mask to keep as a memento. And I can use it as an item. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, right. Now I have fulfilled my promise to you. So please... Give me that which you promised me. I, uh, um, I, I don't have it. <laughs> don't, don't tell me. My mask. You did get it back, didn't you? <laughs> His fucking face. What have you done to me? If you leave my mask out there, something terrible will happen. Oopsies! The mask that was stolen from me. It is called Majora's Mask. It is an accursed item from legend that is said to have been used by an ancient tribe in its hexing rituals. Okay. It is said that an evil and wicked power is bestowed upon the one who wears that mask. According to legend... Yeah. The troubles caused by Majora's Mask were so great... Now... That's a lot of fire. The Ancient Ones, fearing such a catastrophe, sealed the mask in shadow forever, preventing its misuse. And yet... But now, that tribe from the legend has vanished, so no one really knows the true nature of the mask's power. So why do you have it? But I feel it. I went to great lengths to get that legendary mask when I finally had it. I could sense the doom of a dark one omen brewing. It was that over unwelcome feeling that makes your hair stand on end. And now that imp has it. I am begging you, you must get that mask back quickly or something horrible will happen. I'm begging- Him and his fucking jump cut shit, I love it. I'm begging you, I'm begging you, you must do it. <laughs> really? You'll do it for me? I was certain you would tell me that. It's kind of scripted as part of the game. You'll be fine. Surely you can do it. Believe in your strengths. Believe. Believe in the me who believes in you. And that's where we're going to leave it off for today. We're good old Young Link boys now. So next time we're going to go running around and try and actually advance the plot. Oh my god, I look evil right now. My eyes are like soulless. Ugh. Alright guys, but for now, if this made you smile, leave it a like, maybe a little comment. Thanks for watching, and that's for the huge. Everybody remember to stay gold. Bye-bye! Oh, you wanna go? You're gonna destroy me? Is that what you think? Cause listen, lady, you're getting fucked. Look at me. I'm not even taking cover. I'm just shooting at your ass. Oh, I should do. Shields! And then... Barrier! I used to feel the love, guys. Oh, whoa, what? There's lasers in this? What the shit? Yeah, there's lasers in this level, apparently. What the fuck are the lasers for? Oh, whoa, whoa, okay. Oh, my God.